Hello and welcome to Chilly Bee Gaming. I'm Evie and today we're back with some more Starfield. Now last time we spoke to Delgado about our findings at the Key and he tasked us to come here to the Siren of the Stars, which is a luxury liner, and we've come to get the credentials from the Galbank executive who is attending this charity event here. So, let's get into it. Look at this, it's so, so pretty. I like the music too. Now, before we, um, before we start chatting away to people, I think we should maybe go and have a little, a little nose around just to see what's, um, What's occurring? Oh wow, that's pretty. What's in here? Is this the bathroom? Oh, it is. Oh well, all right. Are there any goods? I'm all about the goods, you know me. I am the loot goblin extraordinaire. Oh dear. I suppose that is ours now. It is, Andreja. Hey? I um, I decided it was ours. What's happened here? Brochure. There's a brochure. We're gonna take a brochure just in case. Might be something interesting. If hey, you dude. Have any needs, please enter a request into the computer located at the entryway to your cabin. Oh no, I'm fine, thank you. I, I don't really have a cabin. Unfortunately, Delgado wouldn't spring for it. So it's a vacation, kind of. Please remember to obey all posted safety and mustering instructions. Oh, don't worry, I have will. You tried the canopies? Nope. Horrid. Positively horrid. Yeah, they are. Ooh. I don't think we could ring that. And I need to stop messing. Okay. If you want to dine at Captain Rokov's table during dinner service, it's only an additional 5,000 credits. Jeez Louise! 5,000 credits just to dine so with the. What with the. Aboard? With the Captain Society that view patron. Is absolutely spectacular, isn't it? It is. Hello. It's very, are very pretty. Are you a member of the Society? I am. The member of all societies. Thank you. Right. Excuse me. I can go where I want, love. I am the one and only. Wow. Okay, this is kind of fancy. Oh, look at this fancy, fancy, fancy. Hello. If this is not the very definition of decadence. I do not know what is. No, neither do I, Andre. I, I, honestly. If only Delgado would have sprung for a room for a day, we could have had a nice vacation. It's a restricted area. Anything else here? What is... Oh, it's a vase. D oh, dear. What's happened here? Is it the wall bin messed with? Okay, let's... let's. Oh, do you suppose we could... Zoop. Passenger profile. Passenger name, Vera Gabriel. So, yeah. Status, single passage. Current stay length, single itinerary. Resident status, Dulux. Special instructions, UC Security has authorised this passenger to be armed with and carry a firearm. Please see Trident Operations Manual. Blah, blah, blah. For details or clar clarification. Current cabin status. Entry pro prohibited without cabin pass. Ha. Huh. I wonder if we could... Do you suppose? Do you suppose? Just curiosity. Boom. Whoa, this place is a bit of a shambles, isn't it? Ooh, nice. Okay. Ooh. I mean, I don't really want the ball. It's a ball. All right. What's she got here? Can we? Do you suppose we could just? Yep. Yep. Ah, uh, no, I don't think so. Why are you bring a cushion with you? A little cushion. TV's boss. That's not very good, is it? Ooh. Give me that. I'll eat it. I'll eat it. I thought it was one of those tablet things. I got very excited. Uh, take the ammo. Wow, for somebody who's like travelling one way, this is very extensive luggage. Okay, what's, what's in here? Uh, light particle fuse. Scout's Varun Star Shard. Um, it's got a decent value to it. Okay. Ooh. Oh, ho. no, thank you. Did you pick? Yes. Um, chunks of wine. Why do you keep wine in here? Of all the places. My God. All right. Well. Oh, wonder what's in this room at the back. 
I know this is entirely not why we're, why we're here, but, you know, I'm a pirate after all. Surely I'm supposed to, you know, take stuff. It's kind of part of the, um, part of the, the gig, if you will. Uh, fashionable suit. I... That's fashionable. Get out of here. Good Lord. Is this anything of worthy of note? Nah. Nah. Ooh. Yeah, I'll take the creds. I don't really want the cutlass. It's not my jam. Alright. Yes, like I say, I know that I'm supposed to be on a diplomatic mission, but I'm also a pirate and I also like loot, so... I'm loot- God, she is a messy one! Good grief! Where's... I don't know where that music's coming from. I'm just going to get out. I'm just going to go. Let's just go, Andre. Wait, what? A ball. It's a ball. Andreja, can you come out, please? That's it. Good girl. Can we just... Yeah. All right. Hmm. Whoa. whoa. All right. What's this? Oh, can't go through there. All sorts of fancy little things just around. Hey there. Um, Sorry, I'm busy right now. Claudia Swist. Lovely party, isn't it? I mean, you're not at the party, but okay. That's yeah. You yeah. That's fine. Um. Ooh, hello. Claudia Swist. I suppose we could just do this. I think we could. Passenger profile. Claudia Swift. Swist, excuse me, single passage, single itinerary, due lux. If emergency contact is required, please check passenger cabin of Dumbrov, Dumbrovsky Larry for passenger's current location. Really? Really? Yeah, same again. Okay. Who is detecting us here? Ain't nothing going on, ma'am. Right. We can succeed at that before we are discovered. I'm glad I did, Andreja. There you are. All right. Um. Hmm. Okay. Let's just be a little bit careful. What's in here? Books. Books. Really? Oh. We'll have a look in there in a minute. Hmm. Green fashionable suit. My God. Okay. Nothing else. Notes, but ooh, chunks choco. Sounds nice. Hmm. She likes to carry a lot of books, this one. Good grief. Oops. Right. Yep. Oh, God. Oh, look at that. Another skill point. I will have to start spending my skill points. I've got a backlog of them. Okay. Which is the... Um, Larry... Ah, discover the location of the ES award. So maybe we should go and do that. Maybe we should do that, you know. Because I think the award just goes to the person. It doesn't actually do anything for the charity. Yep. Yep. And that's it. All right. Let's go and find this award, shall we? Can't do anything. I'm out. I'm out. So fancy. Such a fancy place. So it's through there. Oh. Is it? Apparently so. All right. Let's let's see if we can. Um... Oh God! There's more up there. Than... Eve. Focus. Good lord. Alright. Let's if you have any specific requests, please speak to one of the crew's attendants. I'm perfectly fine, thank you. Right, so is that there. Let's go and sort this out first. It might be in one of those rooms up there. We potentially might have been able to find it, so quite a lovely starliner. What? Nothing but the best for the society, huh? An open bar would have been nice. 
but Trident's gouging us for every credit we've got. Okay. For business? Um, Pleasure. I certainly hope they decide to hold all future society events aboard a Starliner. Hmm. Uh, oh. What can you tell me about the Terran Preservation Society? Preservation, yes. Is this about that feature SSNN ran a few years ago? I can assure you, this is a legitimate charity organization. So it's not a legitimate charity organization, then. <laughs> this is going to be the ninth Earth Savior Award ceremony, but the first time it's ever been held aboard a Starliner. Hmm, nice. Okay. Uh, do you know anything about Larry Dombrovsky? Larry has Dombrovsky. an A-level executive rating over at Galbank, which means he has access to everyone's accounts at the touch of a button. Uh, okay. Nice to have met you. Yes, lovely. I'm sure. What about you? Pleased to make your acquaintance. Uh, oh, I've got to stop doing that. Okay, yeah. It's a shame that the Earth ended in such a sorry state. Yeah. But I'm glad the society has the nerve to do something about it. Do you have any information about the award? I heard it's fitted with 12 internally flawless two-carat blue diamonds. Very nice. Can you believe that? Yeah. Uh, yeah, what do you know about Mr. Larry there? Dombrowski is married to some poor woman that he constantly leaves behind in New Atlantis when he goes on his business trips. Mm. All right. Thanks, dude. Mm. Enjoy well, you. That was boring. Well, you're boring and rude. All right. Who are the you? The society chair has really outdone herself this time. Can I talk to you? Okay. What was that motion? Can we, can we talk? Quite oh, a lovely go. starliner. Nothing but the best for the society, huh? Mm-hmm. Okay, what can you tell me? I'm a silver member of the society, but only a hundred thousand more credits and I hit the gold tier. Cool. Yeah, go on. Benjamin Bayou of Neon won the award the first time it was presented. Really? But he dropped out of the society a couple of years back. Um... Do you know anything about Larry? His behavior towards women is abominable. Oh, God. That man really ought to be ashamed of himself. All right. Well, it's, it's been Enjoy emotional. the rest of the event. Oh, I will. All right. So, what brings you aboard? Pleased to make your acquaintance. What do you know about the society, yeah? When you join, they send you a small chunk of rock from the Earth itself. I keep mine on my desk. Very nice. Okay, uh, what about the, uh, the award, sorry? Sheila Holbrook is chair of the award committee this year. The way she dotes over that glorified trophy, you think it was her own child. I'd laugh if it was her behind him. Sheila. Speak to Sheila about the ES award. Hmm. Yeah, well, what do you know about uh, Larry? Yeah. Larry likes to drop overly complex words into conversations. I'm sure he knows that it annoys people, but he does it anyway. All right. Don't forget to donate to the cause. Have I've you just I've got an panel base. Horrid. Positively um, horrid. So I need to speak to this lady. Chair has really outdone herself what, this time. Is she up there? Oops. Sorry. Ah! Okay. Uh, up this way. Oh, there you go. Is this important? I don't have a lot of time for idle nonsense. All right. Yes. I'm extremely busy preparing for the award ceremony, so this better be important. Hmm. When will this ceremony occur? Probably in a few days. I don't want the award transfer to actually occur until we're safely in orbit at our destination. Oh. Of course, if I keep getting interrupted, the ceremony might never take place at all. All right. Uh, isn't it risky holding the award ceremony aboard a Starliner? Not at all. I was assured that this particular ship was outfitted with the absolute latest and cutting edge security. Oh. I am completely confident that Trident Luxury Lines will keep all of us safe. Okay, uh, I hear you're in charge of the Earth Savior Award. Yes, I am. Actually, I've been entrusted with the transfer of the award for the last seven of its nine years. Why do you ask? Curiosity. Um, hmm. You must be nervous keeping something so valuable in your cabin. Hmm. In my cabin? Oh, please. Why would I do something so foolish? I don't know. 
I'll have you know that the award is locked inside the master safe, located at the purser's office. Oh. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have much more important things on my agenda than to speak to the likes of you. Oh, now I'm definitely nicking it. She was rude. Okay, so I need to go to the purser's office. They access the purser's office. Down there. Bloody hell. Up and down, up and down, up and down. Sorry, that bloody hell was very English, wasn't it? <laughs> so it's up here. Through this way. Okay. All right. Any complaints about your All right. So it's this way. Okay, 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 okay. So this is the purser's office, is it? Oh, hello. Glad to have you aboard. Hmm. Wonder if I'll end up having to persuade her. Let's um, let's do a little bit of uh, our usual, our usual antics. Actually, another thing that we can do while we're here, let's have a look at our uh, our social. I'm sure we could use our persuade and oh yeah, we can look. We can upgrade our persuade. Upgrade your persuades. So that's one. Um. Let's see, I did want to upgrade my piloting skill, did I not? Piloting. Oh, bloody hell, we've still got to destroy ten more ships. God bless it, Barbie. All right. Um, hmm, stealth, maybe? Oh, we can upgrade our stealth. Hold on, what are we, what are we, what are we at here? Three or four, oh. You are 100% more difficult to detect when sneaking. Suppressed weapons do an additional 20% sneak damage. Doors you interact with while in stealth no longer alert enemies. <sighs> this is very good for the likes of myself, who is a sneaky, sneaky girl. All right. We'll save the others for now. All right. Welcome to the purser's office. I'm Chief Purser Murata. How can I be of assistance today? Well, hmm... Can I store things with confidence in your safe? Oh, absolutely. The safe is magnetically sealed and shielded with multiple layers of fully damage resistant vacuum proof plating. Okay. In the unlikely event our vessel is boarded and the threat detection alarm is triggered, the safe will be permanently sealed until it reaches port. In the even more unlikely event this ship is destroyed. We can assure you that your loved ones will be able to recover your goods from the wreckage. So, as you can imagine, your property will be completely secure until you decide to retrieve them from our safe. Hmm. Um. I'd like to take it. I think she's just going to say no, but let's try it. I've only seen it briefly myself, but I can assure you that it's quite lovely. Unfortunately, the item is locked inside of our safe which can only be accessed by presenting an appropriate claim ID. Okay. Is there anything else I can assist you with today? Hmm. So we need to acquire. Please let me know if there's anything I can do to make you stay more comfortable. Okay. All right. All right. So we need to get a key. We need to get a key. A key, a key, a key, a key, a key. So... Okay, so it's up here. So who would have it? I imagine it's that woman. Whatever her name was. I can't remember what her name was. I wonder if we could take it off of her. With any matters regarding the security of oh, yeah. items. An open bar would have been Must nice. you continue these unwelcome interruptions? I'm a very busy woman. A very rude woman. Um should we just outright ask for it? Oh, uh, hold on. Uh, yeah, all right. Excuse me? And why in goodness name would I do something as foolish as that? Well, I'll tell you why. Let's and why persuader. in goodness name would I possibly agree to that ridiculous demand? Um. Oh, that's using the thingy, isn't it? Um. I don't have time for this. And neither do I. <sighs> See, if we do that, that'll put us up to three. I don't think we'd be able to do it. I hear you. Oh, she hears me. I hope Ooh. I can trust you. 
Oh, oh hey. Listen, maybe you can keep this between us. If the award goes missing, there's no need for the insurance company to get involved. Well, that was just too easy, wasn't it? That was too easy, folks. But you know what? That's if fine. you wish to have a drink at any of our lounges, be sure to present your cabin Literally garbage. Well, there you go. Baggage hold, probably. Should we take this first? Don't forget to keep your starby. We freaking did it. Alright. So, hmm. Oops. Got to stop doing that. Alright. Hi. The rest of this ship is any indication. I imagine there is an incredible amount of wealth stored in there right now. Probably. All right. Hmm. Oh, God bless it. Oh, detected straight away. Hmm. Ugh. Nah. Yep, yeah, take that. Thank you. Ba da You can't take that away. Oh god. There we go. Uh yep, yep. 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 Alright. And we're done here. We're done here, girl. Andreja, can you come out please? My dear. Andreja, come please. Thank you. That's it. We'll just, we'll just shut this. Can we shut the door? Can we close the door? Will it let us close the door? Oh no. Well, there you go. That was pretty straightforward, wasn't it? Your voyage is unsatisfactory in any way. I'm taking that. I'm taking that. I don't want that. I don't want that. Well, thank you, madam. You've been um, very helpful in contributing to the royal coffers. Did really people would store these toys and stuff? That's a little bit random. All right, but well, there you go. We uh, successfully half inch to the old the old award. Let's have a look at this thing, shall we? Can we see it? Uh, is it in here? So it was called the Earth Savior Award. Oh, we can't see it. Really? Ah, oh, sixty-five thousand credits though. Holy guacamole! I wonder if we can keep that for ourselves. Do you, do, do, do you suppose? Who's this? Oh, we've already been in here. God bless it. Right, so we've been there. We've been uh, in this other woman's place around here. Right, so... Nothing but the finest at this gala. You're not even at the gala. You're sat in the corridor out the back. Don't know why that suddenly gave us some music there. All right. What's, in, what's wrong with these? Is this by design? Laundry services. Oh, hey, dude, you look like you're really working hard. For the here. safety of everyone aboard, please be certain you don't interfere with any of the crew or security members of our vessel. No, I, uh, I, I won't. I'm not particularly interested in doing such a thing. Okay. Anything else? Curiosity. Well, I think we did quite well there, folks. You know. Oh, Larry, here we go, Mr. Larry. Okay. Larry Dombrovsky, VIP, undetermined stay length, Dulux. Okay, please deliver one bottle of ice champagne daily at 11.30pm. Wow. If cabin unoccupied, leave next to passenger bed in silver ice bucket. Well, I wonder what Larry's got in here. Should we, should we take a peep? How quickly can you get that done? Very quickly, as it turns out, Andreja. I am a master lockpick at this rate. My god. Okay. My god. I mean, I like coffee, but Jesus. Did... Alright. Ooh. Canuck. Double double. Hmm. Thank you so much. Take it. Oh. All right. 
trauma pack yet. Take the digipicks. Thank you. Okay. Eh. Wow. Larry, Larry. Oh my god. Oh! There we go. Not in here, is he? No. Looking for any kind of evidence. Anything. Oh, hello. Give me the cred sticks, please. Honestly. Say the the loot goblin, it's it's terrible. Formal slack suits, casual streetwear. Really, you keep coffee and you're safe. I mean, I get it, but dude, no, you can keep the coffee. Consider it my parting gift. Keep the coffee. And here, no. Right, Andre Joe. Let's go. Oh. Andre Jet. Come here, please. Come on. That's it. Close the door. Nobody will know. We are a ghost. A ghost in the night. Stealing from these rich people. Uh, we haven't been in Sheila's place. Bam. Let's have a look at Sheila's info. Okay. Uh, single passage, Dulux, yeah. Direct inquiries in... Direct any inquiries regarding the Terran Preservation Society or the Earth Saviour Award to Miss Holbrook. Prohibited without access. Well... Bum, bum, bum. Wow, a lot of these people are real messy. We okay. have resorted to theft now, I see. Yes. Andreji, you know this about me. I am the loot goblin, my dear. It's how we do... How we do... Th Jesus. This woman likes cake. I mean, I kind of do too. I'm going to pinch one. There we go. She really likes cake and chocolate. I mean, so do I, hun. So do I. Spirit... Spirit character right here. Whoa. And what's these mannequins about? A little bit weird. I don't know how I feel about mannequins just being sort of stood about. A little bit strange. Okay. Ooh. Bathroom, I assume. Yep. Fancy old bathroom. She's got like a proper suite up here, I'm guessing. Jesus, I thought that mannequin was real. All right, anything else? Books. More cake. The woman likes cake. Say, I get it. I like cake. My God. Okay. The woman likes sweet stuff. I get it, believe me. As a lady who who likes the sweet stuff, and I do. You know, I just don't eat it often because, unfortunately, when you eat too much of it, it uh, is not good for you. Very bad for you. Anyway. Well, um, yeah. Oh, God, another one. Grapes and tape. Lovely. All right. Whoop! All right, we're out. Andreja, get out here. Come. On. Okay. All right. Well, we've we've successfully looted, I believe. Uh, yeah, we've been in five. Okay. What's what's around here? Fancy. So fancy. Oh. Is this just an empty suite? Hello? We have a range of excursions available at all of our destinations. All right. All the details are in your care. Oh, hi. Due to an unfortunate accident, we're halting our spacewalk experience for an indeterminate amount of time. Ooh. Daddy, this is an absolute disaster. You never told me I'd only be able to take one valet on this cruise. Imagine how it felt when I had to send the other three home at the Siren's departure station. You won't believe it, but I actually had to carry my own bag. Can you imagine the humiliation? Oh, well, at least the food on board is halfway decent. The wine, however, disgusting. I think Trident neglected to hire a proper sommelier. Thank goodness I brought a few bottles from our cellars. Anyway, that's all for now. I guess I'll see you this when this horror show is over. As always, your loving son, Hannibal. Hannibal? Okay, now how the hell do you 
How do you send this? Hello? Isn't this voice activated? No, you stupid thing. Stop printing what I'm... This is preposterous. Send, send. No, send, you stupid piece of junk. Wait until my father hears about this. Okay, so Grayson is a little bit of a... Um... Myself and the entire team at Trident Luxury Lines, we wish to thank you for choosing to travel with us. Well, no problem. All right. I've done this particular this run several oh, times. Right. I can assure you that the route is quite safe. Oh, I'm sure it is. Right. We now we've got everything. I'm sorry, Let's but unless you're reporting a security situation, I need to get back to my duties. I don't want to talk to you anyway, dude. I'm busy. I've got to go and mingle. Hello? Hello? Are you a member of the society? We already talked. Uh okay. It's absolutely spectacular, isn't it? Yes, can I talk to you? I certainly hope they decide to hold all future society events aboard the Okay, Starlight. absolutely spectacular, isn't it? What do you know about Larry? Yeah. Yes. He's some kind of a top dog over at Galbank. I heard he replaced someone that was caught running a fake loan scam. Hmm. Interesting. Well, That's not really what we're looking for yet. Okay. Excuse me, sir. Can I? Hello? Can we talk? An open bar would have been nice. Yeah. Trident's gouging us for every credit we've got. I'm sure you can afford it. Okay. He's been spending a lot of time with Claudia Swiss. Oh. Quality time, if you catch my meaning. I'm certain his wife doesn't know a thing about it. Oh, interesting. Okay, so we need That's to go then? and speak to that Claudia again. Okay. Hello. I assume you pronounce it Claudia. Or Claudia. Might be Claudia, Claudia. I forgot how he said it. All right. So she is round here. She didn't look particularly happy when we saw her before, but well... All right, madam. Hello. Sorry. Do I know you? Um. You don't know me, but I need some information. Look, I think you're definitely confused here. No, I'm not. I really don't have time to have a discussion with you. My partner's waiting for me. He's a very important man. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Maybe I should talk to his wife instead, yeah. Would your partner happen be happen to be Larry Dombrowski? Who? Look, can you just cut to the chase already? What's this about? Well, maybe I should talk to his wife instead. Yeah. His wife? Uh, oh, for the love of God. Well, I told Larry to keep his big mouth shut, but did he listen? No. He had to impress his friends and treat me like a trophy. Yep. Look, I've been in this business for a long time, and I know how this game works. So let's skip all the banter and get it over with. What's it going to take to make us both happy? Hmm. All I need is something incriminating against him. If I give you dirt on that son of a bitch Dombrowski, all I'm doing is endangering myself. Why would I do that? Well, madam, um... Is our persuade that good, do you think? Should we try it? Mm, oh! Galbank doesn't have an undercover division. Can we stop playing games and get down to serious business here? Well, all right. Um. Yeah. If you had another way to get the information, you wouldn't be dealing. You'd be demanding. All right, the fleet wants information. If you're trying to intimidate me by saying that, it's not going to work. Well, God bless it. You know what? Forget it. The price of doing business by slinging mud is way too steep. What else you got? Oh, have some coin, dear. You're have some coin. Me to give you dirt on Larry. <laughs> Sorry, I, I thought I'd end up on the short end of the deal. Take the money and you know, go. This whole thing really pisses me off. All right. Larry and I had the perfect scheme where thousands of credits all worked out. And then he goes and flushes the whole thing down the toilet. I do not understand. Hmm. Your anger is focused on Mr. Dombrowski, but clearly the failure of this plan rests on you as well. If you had to work near him day in and day out, I think you'd understand. He's a disgusting pig. Oh God. Plain and simple. Lovely. So, all right, well, hmm. How many creds are we talking about here? Yeah. I'm not going to tell you. 
Let's just say that I'd be sent to prison for a long time if Galbank figured it out. No. Oh. Um. You're angrier at him than at him than I expected. That's true. She oh, is. angry isn't even the right word. The plan was solid. Mm -hmm. Larry got together with myself and this other guy, Gabriel Vera. Oh. He's some big wig over at UC Security. Mm -hmm. I doctored the transactions. Larry wiped them off the system. And Vera kept the legal pressure off of us. We were scamming Galbank for months. It was going well until I discovered Larry was cheating everyone by changing each transaction in his favor before deleting them. <sighs> hmm. Okay, um... If you want revenge, give me proof and I'll use it against him, yeah? I wish I had some. Ugh. Maybe you should try talking to Gabriel Vera. He should be around here somewhere. If he doesn't want to cooperate, just mention my name. That should grab his attention. Alright. Good luck. You're gonna need it. Mm-hmm. Well, all right. I hope you hurt Dombrowski. Nail his ass right to the wall. I mean, I don't particularly want to go near that part of his anatomy, thank you very much. All right, where's this dude? Where are you, dude? I thought Gabriel Vera was a woman. Never mind. In the event of a lockdown, remember to return to your cabin in a quiet and orderly fashion. Oh, really? All right. Um, yeah, there he is. So, hey, dude. What brings you aboard? Hello. Hello. You here for the charity event? Mm. I'd rather talk about Larry Dombrowski. Dombrowski, yeah. Dombrowski. Uh, he's the exec holding court over in the VIP area of the ballroom. All right. Yeah, sorry. I work for UC Security, not Galbank. I don't really know him personally. Sure about that? Yeah, Claudia Swist says you have information about Larry Dombrowski. Claudia sent you, did she? Uh-huh. Look, friend, I don't know if you're just a little drunk, maybe a touch crazy, or both. Mm. Whatever you think you know about me, you're dead wrong. So back off. We both know exactly who you are. Yes. Hmm. Yeah, maybe I'll hand over any evidence I already have to the authorities. <laughs> Just in case you weren't aware, I am the authorities. Are you? What? Anything you try to report will boil down to your word against mine. And since I work for UC Security, who do you think people will believe? Hmm. All right. So we need to go and speak to, to Eugene. You, what's he called? Yeah, Eugene? Eugene? I can't remember say his name. All right. Dude. Oh, there you are. I saw your little exchange with Vera. Keep that up and I guarantee that Embassar's gonna demand that you be arrested. Well, he's involved in an embezzlement scheme with... Yeah. Yeah. Which is why he's threatening you. That makes sense. Mm -hmm. We need hard evidence of their scheme. But it's gonna be tricky. The problem is he's not gonna talk to you in public. We need to get Vera isolated so he'll spill everything he knows. Hmm. A shipwide emergency might do the trick. Smart. If there's an emergency, standard practice is for all passengers to clear the decks and report to their cabins for lockdown. I think the best chance we have would be to tamper with the life support sensors. Manipulate a few controls and you can fool the monitoring system into thinking there's a, a life support failure. And there you have your emergency. Hmm. Okay. Uh, the monitoring compensators will just kick in at that point and report a false positive in the sensors to the ship's damage control. Yeah. Well... Sounds like someone has been reading Starship manuals in their spare time. I have no idea what all of that technical jargon meant. But cause enough confusion and it will buy us plenty of time. All One right. more thing. If Chief Engineer Sundin gives you any trouble, tell him I'll erase that gambling debt he owes me. All right. I prefer you use that as a last resort. But hey, what's the harm in losing a few credits when I'm on the brink of rejoining the fleet? All right? Anyway, I better start backing. Things are getting hot around here, and won't be long before Trident figures out you had help. 
Okay. Yeah, where is it located? There's access to the crew section that you can reach through the uh, Starview Bowl. Mm. Chief Sundin should be there, wasting time at the station as usual. Have fun with that guy. He's a, a real piece of work. Lovely. Once you're past Sundin, just look for the room marked Environmental Control. Everything you need is inside. Uh, yeah, well, do you have the lowdown on him? On the surface, he's an upstanding citizen of the United Colonies, pretty high up in UC security. Lots of clout with mast. Underneath is a greedy piece of garbage. Given the chance he'd backstab you for a cred stick and pin the murder on someone else. Come to think of it, if he wasn't such a petty tyrant, he'd probably thrive with the Crimson Fleet. Alright. Get back to it. Yeah, I will. Don't you, don't you I'm worry, sorry, sir. Unless you're reporting a security situation, I need to get back to my duties. Well, you stand there and do your duties then. My God. All right. Here for business? Well, there Where's you it? have it, folks. There you have it. We have looted this place top to bottom. Whee! And now we have to try and, um, find a means Quite to... a lovely Starliner. Nothing but the best for the society. Get to our eh? security friend there. Please remain in designated and, uh, passenger areas at all times. Eventually get journey. some dirt on Dombrovsky. Any complaints about your crews should be directed Dombrovsky. to one of the staff. I can't remember how you say his name. I keep canopies, saying it wrong. Oh, look at all these cred sticks, boring. baby. Oh my god. Can I just take these? Can I literally just take these? Hold on. Oh. I certainly hope they decide to hold all future society events aboard a Starliner. Well, 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 well. I'm just, yeah, this is, this is, I'm taking this. Alright. Well, that was, um, Please remember to obey all that was definitely worth looking at, wasn't it? <laughs> hey! Boof! Right, okay. Next time we will uh, go and find the life support system to make your and uh, sabotage this bad boy. But until next time, be safe, be good, and look after yourselves.